there's a distinct okay. first knock down so we're gonna knock down the enemy that so then it's like the all-out attack do it you do a flip and then you do all these things. You have some sweet jazz in the background. Yeah. So that's last surprise, and that plays in the background of every fight. Believe it or not. Nice going. Uh. Uh, and basically, yeah. I know what it's now used then. for. It basically, it's super good against some enemies. Is there anything down this way? Nope. Okay, cool. And some enemy is not good against? Uh, no. So, like, capturing Persona and everything involves talking to enemies, which involves the same setup as an all-out attack, but you don't get to do an all-out attack. So sometimes you don't want to do an all-out attack. Uh, you actually just want to capture the Persona. Gotcha. E yeah. Um. Yeah, we're almost done with this section. Oh, good. Whoa! Um, yeah, you're about to see, like, he's not just a piece oh, of shit God. who sexually abuses his female students, he also physically yes. abuses all of his students. Oh, yes. How many times do I have to... Um, yeah, Gamashita's, uh, not a good person. Yeah. And I think they go out of their way to make him, like, almost comically evil, just yeah. so, like, you don't feel it? as... Stop. So you don't like him. <laughs> Leave us. Uh... Huh? They put up this huge, there's this huge ethical debate you guys have, and we're going to run through some of that, which is basically like, you guys, uh, do we help? They're, they're like, oh, we could try and steal his treasure, which is like the thing that like helps support the distortion or whatever. And that might change the way he changed his like evil ways, but it could also leave him fucking comatose and like dead. So uh, to like tie into like the, the psychotic break incidents or whatever. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that's what's happening to those people. And so like you're like, oh man, like he's like a legitimately terrible person, but like, is it enough to like potentially leave him comatose? And then it's like, uh, oh yeah, he's like sexually abusing a young girl and cause her to almost commit suicide. Oh, that's a that's a hard yes. Yeah, and it's like, uh, yeah. So you guys are like, so we just become like, oh yeah, fuck this dude. Like in general. These guys as evidence. If it all goes well, we can take down that asshole. Oh god. Yeah. So like we see that, and we go talk to these guys here in like the volleyball tournament. Hey. Um, Come on. We like talk to people in the volleyball tournament, and it's like, uh, what are your thoughts? Yeah, it's Scott Sterling. Yeah. Is he no. You haven't? No. Oh my god. <laughs> of all my, <laughs> yeah, I know. Is that like you not having, you not knowing about the four season of Digimon's theme yes. song? <laughs> yes. Actually, yes. <laughs> Um, I'll have to show it to you when we're done here. <laughs> so there's going to be a lot of Persona episodes. Yeah. So Ugh, even more than already are out. Uh, I'd like to the know how many were out by now. Castle. It's going to be interesting for them because it's going to be like three or four. Yeah. And there's going to be two or three more probably. So buckle up. I hope people are liking Persona. <laughs> yeah, I hope so. <laughs> if not, fuck you, I guess. Oh, now they distinct him as Tractor. Shadow. Uh, yeah, surprise. Kind of so, so this explains that, like, uh, their this kind of explains some of Ryuji's backstory. Where like, You've come along uh, fool. he like, he basically was like, Kamoshida, you're a piece of fucking shit. And then Kamoshida like, uh, broke his leg and kept him away from the track team. And since he was their star, uh, basically he was able then to just like disband, disband the track team. Yeah. Um, because, like, he was told, yeah, you're not supposed to, like, oh, battery's low, time to plug it in. Continue, yeah. Uh, uh, so, like, yeah, he was like, uh, if any more violent incidents happen, uh, we're gonna disband the track team, and then Yuji, like, was just like, fuck you, Kamashita. Or, you know, and, like, it That's disbanded it. the track team, and they were all like, you're a piece of fucking shit, Ryuji, for sticking up for us and, like, destroying our track team. Uh -huh. 
This game has a lot of messages about how people are much more willing to put up with bullshit than we think they are. No. Are you ready? Is this when he gets? You didn't. Yeah, I was about to say you didn't just think that Ryuji was like just some piece of shit that we had to bring along with us. Well, I figured with him being here so much, he eventually get his own persona. Yeah. It wasn't no practice, it was physical abuse. Yeah. You just didn't like our team. And then, and then like, yeah, he's like, oh yeah, the track team, like, the only one he, like, Kamoshida was, like, beating them to death because their coach got fired. Like, he got the coach Man, fired and beat them half to death to break him up so that his volleyball team would get all the attention, so he'd basically be unfireable. What? Oh, the politics of high school. Yeah. <laughs> the school will call itself defense anyway. Damn it. Not only can I not run anymore, the track team has gone too because of this asshole. Yeah, he's. He is not a good person. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Once these two are dealt with, you're next. <laughs> Ryuji! Stand up for yourself, you fucking. <laughs> bitch. Right. Yeah. Everything that was important to me was taken by him. I'll never get him back. That's right, you won't. Stay there and watch. Look on as these hopeless scum die for nothing. You ready? Is it gonna be awesome or is it gonna be kind of a? Did you like the last one? No. I meant like the last. I meant the uh, his persona. Yeah, depends. It's one of those 50 50 You like it, you hate it. Using people. Yeah. You're the real scumbag, Kamoshida. It looks. His is very cartoony. What are you doing? Silence him. Well, there's no guards around him. So. Stop looking down on me with that stupid smile on your face! This is when you take out the brass knuckles and yeah. just beat the shit. <laughs> you made me wait quite a while. There it goes. You seek power, correct? Then let us form a pact. Yeah. And it sounds like it's really like a, like a demon contract that you signed with. Yeah. Well, it's like, uh, so like, the power of Persona, and this is explained later, comes from their ability to, like, basically resist, uh, uh, what, like, the person who's in the palace and, like, the distortion see them as. Oh. oh, god, okay, he has a yeah. skull mask. What can yeah. you do? Cower in fear and watch! <laughs> yeah. You have to, you get the mask, and then you have to rip it off to be able to summon them. Yeah. It's because, like, you're giving that power, like, it's manifestation, I think. Oh, okay. It's a pirate ship? It's a motherfucking pirate, <laughs> is what it is. Okay. <laughs> like I said, it's like 50-50. It's very um, cartoony. Very He even just like a pirate. <laughs> yeah. Right on. What's up, Persona? This effing rocks. Now that I got this power, it's time for payback. Yo, I'm ready. Bring it! Is that a person or is that like a really high level? It, it's sort of like the mini boss. Uh, and it is high level right now. That's an Elegon. For us, it's high level. Captain I think. Ken! And you have to say an Elegon. It's like a level 11 persona. It's the first Emperor persona. Oh, I thought for a moment the horse had a, you know, had a horn. Oh, did he right So all the confidants in this game just kind of interesting game, are named after the Major Arcana of the tarot cards. Oh. And uh, as you... Uh, build them. You Let's also like when you captain. use certain types of persona that are associated with them. Uh, uh, they get more. Uh, oh, he does lightning. Yeah. So he does lightning. His uh, so like his magic stack is really is sort of below average, persona. but uh, he uh, also. So see how he resisted. This is because we're on safe mode that we just like bodied that dude. <laughs> um, yeah. Just to make that clear. Uh, I figured he does. He takes a lot. He has a lot more health if you're on hard. He's probably stronger too. Yeah. And like if Ryuji goes down, you're fucked. Um, oh, he's holding a pipe. Yeah. So, but Ryuji gets like tons of attack. So he and the next character you get. Uh, well, not the next one, but the one after that. Because um, the next one you get, she's really strong with magic. So, like, uh, Anne is really strong with magic. Whereas the next character you get, who we haven't met yet, uh, he's also like Ryuji. He has a lot of attack. And the reason you keep them is that 
your I all out you attack damage is uh-huh. based on the total Seems accumulative you attack of your party. Uh, so when you have those two in, they do massive damage, especially later on. Oh. Yeah. What? Um. What we're going to leave this here as our little commentary that I'm going to do on this What's section is that A, that is not the real one. I figured it wasn't. Um, and B, Kamoshida is a very creepy yeah. person. Yeah. Now that you mention it, but why is she even here? Hey, let go of her. Yeah. Uh, um, I don't really know where to go with that conversation. Okay. So, uh, is- we got to run. Thank God. <sighs> So like yeah, so we run, and basically like the beginning of this game is getting four characters in your party so that you can fight the first dungeon. Makes sense. Kind of what it's about. Let me think about. It. So basically, Mona's like, I have this plan, <laughs> the and you two are gonna help me, and we're like, uh. Thanks for everything, Ken. See you around. But uh, see you around, Ken. We're, we, we're not gonna do that. And then he's he's like, what the fuck, you pieces of shit. Go I ahead. helped you out all this time, and you guys aren't gonna help me out? And they're like, yep, see ya! We got the real world to go back to. You have returned uh, to the- and it's like, you have returned. Yeah, but it's like, holy shit! That's intense fuck <sighs> shit. Thank God. Yeah. I dragged you around. <sighs> uh. I could, I could use a map. I could use a map. <sighs> me too. But damn, I totally remember once we make him fess. Yeah. So it's like, so- hey, yeah. Uh, Let's go look for these witnesses, and it's like, yeah, sure. Now that- hey, if you're thinking of laying low, because you- everyone already- You know, they could just report them to the police, and they just beat the shit out Though, of them. Though, to be fair, the shop and stuff may happen after the and stuff, so we may not have to worry about that. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah, if they just report them to the police, they'll just beat the no shit out of them. And just yeah, it. and they're like, and the police aren't going to believe us anyway. <laughs> but, yeah. It's like, we're going to pump him full of fucking heroin and methamphetamine and beat the shit out of him. And make him sign a confession anyway. Yeah. And so this is where it's like, uh... Back to the... So yeah, so every time we form a confidant bond, uh, we come back here and she like explains like, how is this confidant supposed to help us? And I think this one she's like, you can't you possibly have done all this alone. Who helped you? And like, which is sucks, because it's like Ryuji... Acting as a yeah, so it's like, it's like, uh... You couldn't have done it alone. You, you, uh, you must have had associates. Uh, so tell me who these people Am are. Am I wrong? Right. And like everybody else is like, you had to have gotten these super expensive looking plastic guns from somebody. Who was it? And it's like, you had somebody to run your website. Who was it? You had somebody who like could have been an important strategist to your team. Who was it? But Reed Jesus is like, you couldn't have done this alone. You needed some bitch to help you. Who was it? <laughs> yeah. And so it's like, he's a chariot. Um, and so like if we were gonna play further here, which is probably what we'd be doing in Royal, if these videos do well, I guess. Like if, by the time we get done with these videos and Royal has come out, they have zero views, like uh, a certain Kingdom Hearts video we don't talk about. Yeah. <laughs> um, at the time of this recording, anyway. Um, the hell? Uh, I'm still eating, man. <laughs> calm down. Holy shit. Just hearing your story makes me angry. Yeah, so we explained to him so that, like... So, you left your hometown, and you're living here now, huh? Uh, yeah. All right, then. Is, is that, uh, if we continue this, is that, like, we'd hang out a little with uh, Ryuji just to get Ryuji's confidant level up? Yeah. So that we could get stuff like the Tom Pass from him. So, like, people who don't hang out with the people that are in their party have a, like are going to have a real tough time in this game. Yeah, it's so. And the thing that sucks is, like, every... So, like, Anne, we can't hang out with and boost her confidant level till we're done with Kamashita's palace. So every time she gets a once more, which... Her element is fire, so she gets a lot of them in Kamashita's powers. Uh, you can't baton pass off of her. Uh, and so it's like, you just... Like, you get everybody else down and you just wait till it's Anne's oh, turn. Now we're exchanging phone numbers. Yep, we made a friend. We're gonna start right away oh, someday I hope we have friends. The volleyball rally oh. According to you, I don't have any. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you don't. Wow, <laughs> okay. gag. But, thanks to... Well, <laughs> so I did this YouTube on, thing with you. It's because I hate more. you. Exactly. Yeah. 
Fuck you. If anything, fuck Will. He never shows up. Yeah. Is this her friend? Who yes. Is... It's funny in that, like, she's super important for, like, this section of the game and for, like, Anne's confidant path. But she only shows up for, like, I hadn't been this. Whenever I she, like, kills her herself, she basically. Had... Or almost kills herself. And then, like, and she shows up she one time at the like end of Anne's confidant path. And then nobody else gives a fuck worried. about her it's for the rest of the fucking game. Which is very, um... Like, she's not even mentioned. It's not even like, yeah, that girl who killed her, almost killed herself. I hope she's doing okay or whatever. Yeah. More importantly, was that injury okay? It looked really swollen. Yeah, and so Anne's like, man, you're like getting the shit kicked out of you at these volleyball Especially games. And it's like, no, we're okay. Uh, I have to work super hard. And, like, she's having to, like, put up with Kamoshida because, like, Kamoshida's like, I'm going to take... I'm gonna take Mr. her off the volleyball Kamshi team. Told yeah. Get you. Uh, which is like what is he some of the weakest blackmail on the face of the saying. planet. But I guess like if you're Japanese, it's like super hardcore. Because like me, I'd be like, "Fuck it, take her off the volleyball team. I don't care if that's her dream. I'm not sucking your dick." Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? I'd be like, "You can go fuck yourself. I'm gonna go call the police. Tell them you tried to touch me." And these are American police who like well, take who like beat the shit out of suspected kitty diddlers, yep. even if it's not true. Yeah, essentially. <laughs> you know, apparently the Japanese police aren't the same way. The Japanese police are like, oh, I guess you got gay diddled. Oh, well, whatever. Oh, In America, they're like, fuck, he might be a child molester. <laughs> Hold still. We're going to arrest him without any evidence. I don't know which one's better, but I would hope the American, I think the American system, where it's like, uh, you actually went to school today. Uh, of course. I mean, technically we went to half yeah. school yesterday. <laughs> yeah. And he's just like, go fuck yourself. Listen go upstairs up. and masturbate. Leave me alone. <laughs> he's very gruff in the beginning of the game, but like by the end of the game, he's like team dad. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> Who's <Nope>. this? <laughs> uh, got it. <laughs> You're a bro, man. Yeah, man. We have a friend. Oh, Look God. at that. We have one friend. They call us a bro. Yeah. It's really fun, because he's like, at the very beginning, he's like, Go fuck yourself, kid. I'm gonna go home. Don't go anywhere. You're locked up now. It's not like, check a lot. <laughs> yeah, don't leave anywhere. Uh, and then, like, by the end, yeah, he's like, Team Dad. I'll but, just add this. Yeah, man. Uh, we've been playing for a while. Yeah. We're gonna keep going. Uh, do we want to end this episode, though? Yeah, I think we should. Okay, cool. This is the end of this episode. And uh, if you guys like this stuff, uh, like, comment, do all that stuff, and uh, subscribe, because this would be really helpful. Yeah. And uh, we will see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.